So I am actually staying at the Home 2 Suites by Hilton over here in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. I think it's Wisconsin. I'm terrible at geography. But yeah, we're staying at the Home 2 Suites by the Hilton. And this is actually surprising. I noticed this when I walked into the hotel room. I think this is a pet friendly place because they have a door tag that says pet inside. So that's actually pretty cool. Staying in room 307 on the third floor. This is the very top floor of the hotel. And what's neat is that they have the same room key technology that Disney has is with the RFID system. So my keys are inside here. Let me go ahead and open that up. And here we are. So the very first thing you see when you walk into the room is of course the king size bed over here. But if you come over here, we have a full refrigerator. I already put some stuff that I was traveling with in there. I'm gonna fill it up a little bit later. It's even got a little freezer. It doesn't have an ice maker on the inside. I see an ice tray back there, but I'm, I'm gonna need a little bit more than that. Uh, that's kind of disappointing. But anyways, got some drawers in here, a full set of utensils. Even if you want to be Michael Myers for a little bit, you got that right there. Let's see what else we got in here. A few uh, pots and stuff. Some towels. Oh, we got a toaster and a strainer. That's very nice. Full sink. Got a nice Keurig over here. That's how you know we're in a nice little hotel if they got Keurig. Dishwashing stuff over here. We even have a dishwasher. That's actually really cool. I didn't notice that when I first walked in. And the trash can over here. Got some of our coffee stuff over here for making your coffee. A little ice tray thing over there. Uh, I'm going to have to find the ice machine in this hotel. Got some glasses over here. Mugs for coffee. A nice microwave. Is it clean on the inside? It is very clean on the inside. That's awesome. Got some plates and some bowls. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be having cereal out of these bowls. This is kind of a small bowl. Anywho. But yeah, this is the little kitchen portion of the, of the room, which is really, really nice. And then we turn to the other side, and we have the bathroom. Which is, in my opinion, one of the most important. Oh, so that, this door moves. This is a pocket door. Huh. I just kind of leaned up against the door. I didn't even realize it was a pocket door. Interesting. Interesting. Camera, focus, please. There you go. Unfortunately, I do not have a bathtub, but I have a stand-up shower that is pretty roomy. And this is kind of weird. The, the handle thing for the shower, you would expect the head to be right above the shower handle, but nope, it's right on the other side. So, if you're coming here, I don't know what this is. I think this is like a push thing for shampoo. Here, let me go inside here. I hope I don't turn this thing on on myself. Um, oh, that is dope. That is dope. I've never seen that before. That's really cool. Huh. I guess it keeps people from stealing all the hotel shampoos and stuff. That's really cool. And of course we have the John over here. Um, this thing has two buttons. Um, okay, that's a light flush, I believe. Oh no, this is... That's little flush, this is heavy flush. So this is for number one and this is for your number twos. You got Neutrogena brand soaps and stuff over here. Oh, they have conditioner and stuff right here. There's conditioner and that's body lotion. So no shampoo. You got a vanity kit and shower cap. Oh, goodness me. Who uses a shower cap? Oh, well, women, I guess. <laughs> you got towels down here. You got your full-size body towels, little hand towels, and I think this is a floor towel. I'm not too... Nope, this is a floor towel. I do believe that's a floor towel. This is like a medium-sized towel for whatever. Hello. Hi. So that's the bathroom. Really nice. Really nice. And I put my bags on the side over here. I literally walked into this room like five minutes ago. Got a nice couch. I don't know if this pulls out into a bed. I would expect it to. I don't know what you call this thing. I'm terrible with furniture, but it's a, it's a, it's a foot thing. You put your feet on it lights over here another mirror right over here hello and paintings on the wall I really like this room and of course 
I, 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 when I came in here, I requested a king bed to see if they, you know, just to see if they had any. Because I did some research on this hotel right before I came, and I saw that they had rooms with king's beds and with two queen beds. And I asked them kindly if they had a room with a king bed, and sure enough, they had one on here. So, that is absolutely fantastic. I'm so looking forward to star fishing on this bed tonight. Uh, we have the window over here. Let's see if we can find the view. Does this thing come up? Uh, yep. Yeah, This is the view from my hotel. We have the Hilton Garden Inn right across the way. Not too bad. It's kind of chilly here. Um, it's in the 50s right now, but there is a cold front coming through tonight, so tomorrow it is going to be in the 30s. Not looking forward to that. I'm going to go ahead and lower this thing down. I don't want nobody peeping into this room. Now, this is something that really caught my eye is that this is an air vent over here. I believe so, yeah. This is an air vent over here. The cool air is coming out from here. And they have this plastic thing on it to direct the air out this way. And this is something that's really cool. Like, I actually really, really like this. I've, I've never seen this in a hotel before, but as soon as I saw it, I knew what it was because it's blowing the air that way into the room instead of just like this. A lot of hotels will just have the air vent there, but it'll just be blowing in one specific section and the entire room won't feel it. So that's very nice. A plus. A plus, I like that. Then you have a closet space. We got some hangers that I'm gonna be utilizing. We got my iron, ironing board. We have a luggage rack. And we can close this thing. Little curtain. And the room comes with a nice little desk, a little workspace area. I already got my laptop set up. Um, updates required, no. You can go ahead and keep that to yourself. Got my computer over here for when I'm editing this stuff later and when I'm doing my other training work that I need for this trip. My computer's being weird. Uh, but yeah, um, I already sat down in this chair and it's very comfortable. This desk right here, this brown thing, pulls out so I think you can roll it to anywhere in the room that you want, which is actually really, really nice. Got a TV here, LG. I'm very excited about that. I put my phone down over here. TV remote, uh, that's a channel guide right there. Got your standard drawers and of course the holy bible that is right there really nice and we have some extra bedding materials right there and i think that about sums up the room oh wait nope forgot to show you this this is interesting i've never been in a hotel that had this before i guess this is in case this pulls out into a bed and you want to be separated from your guests you can just close that thing up on them that is really really cool so yeah that about sums up the room I'm gonna go ahead and close this that about sums up the room I will be sure to go down to the lobby and show you guys the rest of the hotel a little bit later but for right now I'm going to unpack and as you walk outside the room we can look down the long hallway of hotel rooms this this hotel is pretty linear with how it is designed. Not too far from the elevators and ice and vending. Looks like it's right here, so that's very good. Because ice is definitely what I need. And since this hotel is really close to the airport, I have an airplane here. Oh, these things actually move. Interesting. And here you go, here is the ice machine. Came outside the hotel lobby in the chilly air real quick to show you this. This is cool. Nice little fire out here. Oh, I can already feel it. It's nice and it's nice and chilly outside, but you know what? That fire, fire feels absolutely fantastic. I'm gonna walk inside the hotel now and show you guys exactly what we got going on here. Home two suites. This is the main lobby area. You have the front desk over there. Have a group hangout area over here. A place to hang out. A TV. And we are in Wisconsin. Right along the lakes. I believe this is going to be the breakfast area over here. 
So we'll be definitely checking this out in the morning. Some more rooms down here. We got restrooms over here. Some more hangout space over here. Little desks and computers for us to use just in case we need anything. Got some snacks and drinks to purchase over here in the lobby. Really cool stuff. We have all the prices over here for everything. Not bad, not bad. We have the elevator area over here and then the gym over here. I'll be sure to come by here later when there's no one in there because I don't think people would like me filming them exactly. Another ice machine down here. And then the laundry room over here. Laundry service is actually free here at this hotel, which is really awesome. I just found this out. There is a pool at this hotel. Oh my goodness. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Okay, I gotta go in here. I gotta go in here. Wait, do I need to, do I need to, uh, uh, how do I? How do I do this? Are you freaking kidding me? They have an indoor heated pool area. What the heck? I wish I brought my bathing suit. I honestly did. It is nice and warm in here. They have a hot tub in here too. Oh my goodness. Definitely no diving in the hot tub. But oh my god, like, this is where I'm going to come to relax. This is amazing. Definitely not going to be getting any sun in here. But wow. I wonder if the water's heated. I'm sure it is. I'm the only one in here right now. This is kind of weird. The water's heated. That is really nice. Oh my gosh. This is actually like, I'm kind of freaking out about this. This is awesome. Was not expecting this. All right, so it is now the next morning and this is our breakfast service. We have our coffees over here and hot water for your tea. We have all your creams and sugars over here. Got some mugs for everyone in case they want one. Down here we have our milks and yogurts. We have our cereals. We have the sweet, which is looks like Lucky Charms. Healthier, which is I think Rice Krispies, and healthiest, which I just is like granola. We have donuts. We have muffins, bagels, and sweet bread. Your toaster over here for all that. What are you doing? A toppings bar for your oatmeal over here. Really nice. Different microwaves for things that you might want to heat up as well. Now this is really cool. They have different pre-made sandwiches here for you. It's like a sausage, egg and cheese sandwiches. That's really nice. You have your sweets over here. The cinnamon rolls, some fruits which they need to refill. Bananas which aren't the freshest looking, but eh. And over here we have your waffles. I have mine going right now. You take the cup and you just fill it up and you just pour it in there and flip. And then we have your cream cheese and all the other items you might want for your waffles or bagels. And with that, we are going to wrap up this hotel tour for the Home to Suites by Hilton over here in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you want to see more videos like this in the future, be sure to leave a like down below, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment down below if you want to see more. So with that, I am off and I will see you guys in the next video.